Today, Americans of all creeds, colors, and national origins are celebrating Independence Day. But this wasn't always the case. After the Civil War, many white Southerners refused to celebrate the 4th, while newly liberated African Americans embraced it. Vicksburg, Mississippi, stung by their surrender to Union forces on July 4th, 1863, didn't celebrate until 1945. And it was often immigrants who embodied the spirit of July 4th, said Ellen Litwicky, author of America's Public Holidays. In 1876, the centennial celebration in Chicago saw Irish, Polish, and German immigrants turning out in grand fashion, but very few native-born Americans. Immigrants, added Litwicky, could savor the ideals of freedom and democracy. Those are ideals we're all savoring today, no matter where we come from or what we believe. And what could be more American than that? That's a page from my notebook. I'm Katie Couric, CBS News.